hi everyone welcome back to my youtube channel it's amanda and i figure today i'm gonna be doing the last of the try on clothing series for pre-pregnancy clothes that is because i'm having my c-section tomorrow so this is quite literally the last chance we're going to get that i have my belly so i wanted to um, make as many videos as i can and Today is just the last day, so we're gonna try our best here. I'm um, 39 weeks, three days today. I'm gonna be doing three different outfits. One of the outfits I actually have a picture of me in um, when I was barely pregnant. It was in October. That's when I found out. It was like a few weeks after I found out. And I'm gonna have to show you guys the difference between then and now because it is insane. The other two outfits are just gonna be some outfits that I picked out that I would typically wear before I got pregnant. Jeans, of course, and I have some like camo pants that are, that I thrifted. So I think that'll be good. I'm gonna do the leggings first, cause I think that'll be the easiest. Kind of like a bra, this is like wrinkled, but whatever. Then we have like some plaid pants, legging pants. All right, so I managed to get into this and obviously this was so easy. I'd probably wear this outfit just like now because it's it's actually kind of cute, not gonna lie. So the top fits fine. Like these tops have always fit me. That's why I love them so much. Like it doesn't matter how much my, my chest grows. It just always fits because the material they're supportive for me and I love them and then we got the plaid pants it's so weird seeing my belly like my belly button it fits because they're leggings obviously they're not maternity leggings or anything but I can try to pull them up but then it kind of just looks weird of the look uh the other outfits are definitely going to be like completely different than this just because they're not leggings like they're not gonna fit like this it's gonna be more of a hassle to get on i kind of even i low-key got out of breath putting these on i don't know how i mean i'm almost 40 weeks pregnant obviously that's why but like talking is like like a chore like a effort i think the camel pants might be um a little bit easier so i'm gonna do that not gonna force myself to do too much just yet. So what I have here, I have like a little black crop. These vintage camo pants, which were my go-tos before I got pregnant. I love them so, so much. I love some vintage stuff. I just realized from like the top portion, you can't even realize I'm pregnant. Like obviously you wouldn't be able to, but like I feel like I didn't gain any weight. Like I'm just all belly and it's really so weird. Just the top. And I'm not wearing a bra, I'm sorry about that. But you got, the, you got the gut. The camo pants really, I tried. But like they low-key fit, like it's not like they would fall down or anything. So if I wanted to wear these, I would just like, you know, manage it if I wanted to. The little butt. <laughs> I just love these pants so much. This is definitely a typical outfit I would wear. Just can't wait to get back into my old clothes, to be honest. I have so many clothes that I just haven't been able to wear for so long. And I feel like they've just been sitting in my closet. And I'm like, what should I do? Like, should I just remove them or stay there until I'm not pregnant anymore? And you know what's interesting? I've actually gotten like some stretch marks right here on my belly button. And like... I started to get them here actually like really recently and that was my prediction like in all my videos I've been like I'm probably just gonna get them at the end in like the final weeks because that's just my luck and yeah so I've been getting them but it's also because there's like a lot of veins in this area that they look darker or whatever but they're definitely some stretch marks Sorry I'm only doing three outfits, but I'm like, I really don't want to push myself today. I really want him to stay in there till tomorrow for that C-section because I just don't want to deal with the extra stress. And my husband's not home right now, so I'm like, if I went into labor for putting on clothes, I really, I don't know if I could forgive myself. <laughs> this is the last one, and I love the shirt. It's so soft. A little tank top. Beloved jeans. I did try these on in the try on jeans video, but now I'm even bigger. I doubt these are gonna fit. They didn't fit last time. They're not gonna fit again. But it's just gonna look even worse now. For all three of these outfits, I think this was definitely the one that took 
the most effort obviously because they're skinny jeans they're not going to be pleasant to put on of all of them this one is definitely the one that took the most effort top is so cute like all the tops have been so cute they fit fine but i'm just feeling some pain he's just pushing on all my organs jeans obviously they're not gonna fit but i'm surprised like they fit over my hips thank you guys for sticking through this video of this embarrassment stay tuned for a update video after he's born i'm obviously having a c-section i'm gonna have to recover for a decent amount of time so i'm just gonna try and get some videos out and pre-film and get some content out for you guys so you're not like just waiting for an update and you're like what's going on i am glad you made it to the end give this a like if you enjoyed watching this silly video and the last trying on pre-pregnancy clothes until I'm no longer pregnant like that's that's crazy to me I've been pregnant for so long and tomorrow I'm just not gonna be pregnant wow I'll see you guys in my next video peace out